What's going on YouTube? Alex Levito. Thanks for coming back to the channel. Today we're getting into how to wear sunglasses. So now that we're in summer, I think sunglasses are a great thing to know how to wear because you could probably be wearing them every single day. Once you're going out to the pool, once you're going just outside in general, that's really any time of the year because your eyes do need to be protected from the sun at all times. So today I thought it would be easy just to go over some simple sunglass tips that I could give you guys to help you guys out through the summer. So guys, there's two ways to get a good measurement of your face and what really should go on there as far as sunglasses. Of course, you can just go to the store and try on a million different pairs and say, okay, this one works, this one doesn't work, this one's kind of in the middle, I'm not really sure about, but there's really some specific things that you can look for before you actually go to the store and waste all your time on doing that. So the first method we're gonna use is the shape of your face. The shape of your face is really gonna determine what kind of sunglasses, what kind of shape you can put on your face. So essentially there's four different kinds of faces and these kinds of faces have to do with shapes. So the first one is gonna be a triangle shaped face. The second one's gonna be a square shaped face. The third one's gonna be an oval shaped face and then the last one's gonna be a circle shaped face or a rounded shaped face. So you're gonna to wanna to figure out what kind of shaped face you have. For me, I think I have a triangle face because it points down towards my chin and if you do like this, it's a triangle. So basically when you have a face like mine or a square face, since you have a more of a boxy kind of look, you wanna go for something that's more rounded when it comes to sunglasses. So if you have a round face, you're gonna to wanna to go with more pointy sunglasses. So there's a correlation between pointy edges in more circular shapes. So I filmed a challenge the other week called the Zayn Malik challenge and how to dress like him. You guys can go check that out later, but I got these glasses in that challenge. Now I just naturally lean towards this circular shape for my face just because I thought it looked good on me. So the same goes with these. I bought these in the same exact challenge and these are definitely circular. They have a little bit of structure right here with this wire, but you can definitely tell they're very circular. Same thing, I bought these in the Zayn Malik challenge as well and they're both circular. These are obviously very, very circular. So these glasses are from the Kingsman movie and without a biased opinion, I would say that these glasses fit my face very, very well. And I would say that the rules that I explained with the two shapes that correlate between each other, the pointy edges and the circular, I wouldn't say those rules are set in stone, but I would say it's a really good rule of thumb to start out with. So the second more secret way that you probably don't know about, and I just recently learned about, is these little numbers on the inside of the sunglasses. So there's three little numbers you're gonna wanna pay attention to. The 145 here, that is the temple length. The second number in the middle is gonna be the bridge width, and the last one is gonna be the lens width. Basically, these little numbers are gonna help you dictate what kind of sunglasses are gonna be fitting to you. So you might go in a store and see different numbers on different sunglasses, and I would choose the number that suits you the best. Over time, you'll try on more sunglasses and figure out what numbers exactly work for you. So the first number we're gonna go over is the temple length. So basically the first number on here, 145, is gonna dictate how long the temple length is gonna be. So as you can tell, it's a little bit behind my ear and that's a pretty good length for me. This might be a little bit too long, so I might want like a 140, which would be a little bit shorter than the 145. And this is gonna help my glasses stay in place behind my ear. So these glasses have the same thing, 145 on the temple length. I would say 145 actually fits me pretty well. 140, maybe I could do that, but I haven't tried on 140s, I don't know what the big difference would be and how it would actually fit on me, but I would say that 145 is a good length for me. So the next number we're gonna go over is the bridge width, and that's gonna be the middle number when you're looking at the glasses. So when we're looking at the bridge width, it's gonna be the connecting part between the two lenses in the middle. So this one is a 22 and this one is a 21. So as you can tell, this one's a little bit wider than this one. So the big difference between the two is how they fit on my face and how far away they are on the side of my cheek right here. So you don't want your glasses to ultimately rest on your cheek because that's gonna create wrinkles over time and it's gonna irritate your skin. Now with these, these gonna hang off my face a little bit more and that's why I said they're a little bit big. And I didn't even know about these numbers, but I can tell that they come all the way down past my nose pretty much and that's not something you want. They're gonna be slipping off my face all the time like that. Okay guys, so the last number all the way to the left is gonna be the lens width. So basically all the lens width is, is the distance, how long the lens actually is from side to side. So obviously these lenses are a lot bigger than these lenses and a lot longer. So the Gucci sunglasses are a 52 millimeter. That's how long they are. And these are a 48 millimeter. So as you can tell, the Gucci's are a little bit longer lengthwise as far as the lenses go, 
and that's gonna make a major difference on your face when you're wearing them. So that's why these are a little bit bigger and they look a little bit wider on my face. But the Kingsman glasses are gonna be a lot more fitting to my face because they're less millimeters than the Gucci sunglasses. So overall, those are my two tips and methods to help you guys find some cool sunglasses in the future when you're going out to a store and trying to find some new sunglasses. That's gonna wrap it up. Thanks for coming back to my channel and watching my videos. Guys, please subscribe, leave a comment down below, and let me know what method you think was more helpful. Also, leave a like on this video, and I'll see you guys next time. This is Alec. Peace out.